So we're now out front of the Qingdao Brewery. You hear fireworks and that down the distance, coming down where that smokestack is. Lots of bars all over that side of the street, and most of them prominently selling Qingdao beer. We are near Qingdao Valerium City. Now, we enter the building where they make one of the tastiest beers. So we're now in the grounds of Tsingtao Brewery to start the first part of the tour. I love those storage tanks. I gotta get me some firecrackers. Left turn, Clyde. I love that fountain. It shut off because it's the winter, but when I was here the first time, it was really nice with the water coming up. And so this will be the first building we go to, and then we'll go over to that one. So they've got a nice little park here with sculptures to look at. And The guy carrying the keg of Qingtao, Qingtao beer. Kind of partial to the horse statues. That area is staff only. Kind of partial to the horse statues because that's my symbol. The horse. Oh, nice. I love the look of old buildings like that. This little pond. And there's Al way over there. Hi Al. Okay, this is actually a statue of Dionysus, the god of wine. And the god in charge of brewage and bacchanal. He's not only credited with the invention of winemaking, but also the symbol of diligence Cultivation, harvest, and joy. At the time of Sing Tao Beer's centennial anniversary, the god of wine is coming. Facing the sun glow, treading, treading the spray, and raising the beer full of sincere Sing Tao beer liquor. So that is a keg of Sing Tao that Dionysus had. All hail mighty Dionysus. All right. So this is the entrance to the main building. Some ornate Chinese style vases. The world of Tsingtao. We're about to enter. Come with us if you dare. <laughs> <laughs> 